Okay guys, I'm just going to do a um, video for you. Um, you're wanting to know about doing a video on the Nokia A72 for the web browsing and um, basically the sensitivity key, this. And it is set to high, which I'm, I haven't got to be stand with it, so I'm using just freehand, but I'll do my best. Right, I'll show you that I've set the sensitivity to high. I actually didn't know you could do this on this phone, so thanks for doing that. Even though I didn't know how to do it. Right. There, um, there, as you can see there. Sense to be when I actually looked at first, it was just on medium. So now it's on high. Um, as you can see. Works very, very well. Nice and smooth. Um, I've actually had to go with a Blackberry one. And I would still definitely say this one had some little advantages simply because on the Blackberry one it's not so like I, I don't know how to put it, like if you've got more option if you don't ever want to like just nice scroll and flick through, you always get the option of just clicking. Which is just a nice easy way but scrolling is it's nice to have both options I would say. So we'll go into the web browser and then we'll have a go look at some web pages. Sorry. Well, there's YouTube. I'm scrolling with that little thing. It's nice and easy. It always goes on every icon. But for the internet, just web. Right. Um. Think of a website. Looking for play.com or something like that. Um yeah, let's type it in. Sorry, it's a little bit slow, um, simply just because I'm using my mobile um, internet, which is actually pretty quick. I mean, it's done that already. That was pretty fast. I could have used Wi-Fi, but uh, I just used the mobile one. So here it is. Um, I'll wait until that actually, that's actually done. Right there. So this is what it looks like. This is actually just like the real one. Um, so scrolling using this key, as you can see. Nice and smooth instead of holding that, which just hoises straight through. This one is nice and smooth for more accurate, I would say, more accurate like hitting, like straight to games. It's just a lot easier and smoother. Um, so yeah, it's really nice using this. Like clicking down, it all goes to each and in every individual selection, like computing. Um, if I zoom in, as you can see. Just flicks on each and every individual one, which is really handy instead of missing the one which you want. So, for the internet, using this, this is really good. And there's also a thing with Nokia where if you hold down on this, where you press down, it'll give you like a little box there. You can see that, which lets you just go, like it's zoomed out of the page so you can see where you want to go. And also, you can still use that to do that. Just a more precise way to hit on what you're looking for, and that's really good, I would think. Because if there's something right at the bottom of the screen, you don't want to sit at the hole for ages. The big screen can show you exactly where it is. As you can see, play.com has a pretty big web page. So, there's using this. That's just for the web. So, I'll do one for... I think somebody was actually asking us about a Facebook one. Now, this isn't my Facebook I'm logging into, but I can show you as you can see this is somebody else's if it's still logged in and um, yes it is so this is Facebook still using this as you can see Facebook just people's statuses and stuff like that um, if you were to go on your profile which this is the hair profile. Just scroll through stuff like this. 
Um, download Facebook bookmarks, your A72. Lots of stuff like that. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. Let's see what friends would look like. I actually don't have Twitter, so I kind of do one on that. But um, yeah, still using the track, the track and key thing. Really good. Actually, it's really, it's actually even better for Facebook. I would say, if you're going to use it, it's really easy to click onto people's names just like by the swipe of a little thumb. It's really good. So yeah, that's that for Facebook. Um, also, um, it's pretty good for the contacts and messages and such, as I'll show you. That just quickly flicking through them all is really nice. Just a different way of doing it. So um if there's anything else you'd like us to do, just give us a message and I'll sorry I took so long to put this up. But um Yeah, that's that's what it's like. I'm I'm actually gonna leave mine sensitivity on a high. Um because it's a lot better actually even I can't really notice a difference from medium to high, but it is a little bit quicker. As you can see, it's pretty quick and responsive. As soon as I hit it, this move on the other one, I could do that, then it wouldn't. I mean, it's pretty good. So, there's the video for that. Let us know what you think, and um, remember to rate, comment, subscribe. Thank you.